Hello today's video we have the following content. Mo Yu Yun Jian, 30-year-old Jin Lingchen plays the father of 22-year-old Wang Xingyu, how can young actors play? Mo Yu Yun Jian is a very popular drama, but Wu Jinian's performance in it has been complained by the audience. Everyone thinks that although her eyes are big, they look quite empty and seem to have no spirit. She mainly relies on her mouth to express various emotions, which looks a bit awkward. Let's talk about her appearance. She doesn't seem to meet everyone's expectations of the heroine. In general, the audience thinks that her acting is not very good. Speaking of Amy, who plays the little maid Tonjer, it really makes people's eyes light up. She is only 16 years old, but she has grown so beautiful, and her acting is very natural and smart. From this point of view, her future acting career must be long, and she has a bright future. Princess Wan Ning played by Li Mang is really impressive. Although she doesn't have many shots in the play, she is eye-catching every time she appears. The character of the crazy princess she played is simply three points into the wood, as if she is that character, and her acting is really great. Speaking of Yang Che Oiu, although she may still have room for improvement in acting, her beautiful face alone is enough to make Wu Jinian feel stressed. She is obviously playing a supporting role, but her appearance is more eye-catching than the female lead. It is really amazing that she doesn't leave any chances for other actors. In this drama, there is a male actor who really makes people shine. His performance is particularly outstanding, which simply refreshes everyone's understanding of the character. How did he do it? Let's take a look together. Zero One playing father and son with an eight-year age difference. The role of Xiao Heng played by Wang Zhengyu in the drama is just like the standard male lead template in ancient Chinese novels. He looks so powerful and seems to be fearless, but in fact, he had a miserable childhood. This setting is really interesting. It makes people feel sorry for him and want to see how he counterattacks. Xiao Heng, he has admired his father since he was a child, and always wanted to go to the battlefield with him to kill the enemy. But who knew that after that separation, he would never see him again. It makes people feel sad to think about it. When the audience saw this plot, they were stunned and their jaws almost dropped. Who would have thought that the role of the male protagonist's father would be played by Ji Lingchen? This is such a big surprise. I never thought that he would appear in this drama before, and he would play such an important role. It seems that the casting of this drama is really worth watching, and it makes people look forward to it. To be honest, although everyone may still remember his classic performance scenes in Infinite Beyond Class 2, his performance in the new drama this time really made me shine. He played the role of Ji Lingchen very introverted, no longer so flamboyant, and felt like a different person. This change is really good. In fact, the role of Xiao Minghun is just a quick glance in the male protagonist's memory, and there are not many scenes, so the test of acting skills is not that great. In addition, Xiao Minghun is a decent person, so the impression left on the audience is naturally good. This time Ji Lingchen played Xiao Minghun, and everyone looked at it very well, and felt that he played it well. What is even more impressive is that he is really brave. Ji Lingchen is only 30 years old now, which is the golden age of male actors' careers. It is a good time to show his talents. Although he has not yet reached the level of playing the leading actor, he can definitely develop into roles such as the second male lead and the third male lead, and strive for better opportunities. We have to take it step by step, start with small roles, so that we can gradually improve ourselves and move to a bigger stage. Don't be discouraged, just work hard. To be honest, no one expected Ji Lingchen to take the path of playing a father, and in the new drama, he has to be a father to Wang Xingyu, who is eight years younger than him. This mentality is really not something that ordinary male actors can have. To put it bluntly, this acting career path seems simple to get started, but it is really difficult to get out of it. In the future, the dramas that come to him for acting are likely to be similar roles, which makes people a little worried that his acting path will be too narrow. In fact, judging from Ji Lingchen's performance, he really put a lot of effort into this role. In the drama, he didn't try to act cool or handsome. He didn't even try to hide his stubble. His dark circles and eye bags were so obvious that he appeared without makeup. It can be seen that he was very attentive to this choice and really respected the role in the audience. The appearance of this character doesn't need to be too explosive. The key is to show the toughness of a general. In this regard, Ji Lingchen's performance is really eye-catching. It is like giving a vivid lesson to those actors who can only pretend to be young, letting them know what real acting is. Zero two middle-aged actors should not pretend to be young. There are so many people pretending to be young in the entertainment industry now. 
However, this phenomenon is not only the patent of actresses, but also the burden of idols. Sometimes they also like to pretend to be young, as if an old cucumber must be painted with a layer of green paint. People are really speechless and shake their heads. Let's take Ren Zhang as an example. Do you know Ren Zhang? He is the kind of person who is very reliable and can handle things. His existence is like the kind of person who gives people a sense of stability and security. As long as he is there, I feel very at ease in my heart, and any problems and difficulties seem to become less scary. So, Ren Zhang is really a good role model for people to trust and rely on. In the play Lady Kaiaguo, the male protagonist Feng Bao played by Ren Zhang was a young man full of ideals and ambitions when he first appeared. He was still a bachelor and had not married yet. In the lifespan and living environment of ancient people, the age of this male protagonist is estimated to be only in his teens, and should not be over 20 years old. People at that time usually matured earlier, so the male protagonist of this age was already considered a young man and began to assume some responsibilities and obligations. However, compared with modern people, he is still a young man with a lot of room and possibilities for growth. To be honest, Ren Zhang is now 44 years old, definitely a middle-aged uncle, and, like many middle-aged people, he has gained some weight. His image in the camera is really hard to describe. He looks like a big fat face with pits and bumps on his face. He looks like a middle-aged uncle, but he pretends to be young and cute in front of his father. It really makes people want to vomit. I almost vomited the food I ate yesterday. This guy is not joking when acting. It's like he is fighting hard. Unlike other people who act to make money, he acts like he is challenging the limits of life. Every time I watch him perform, I can't help but sweat. He is too dedicated. Also, don't forget Zhang Han. He is also a very outstanding artist and has always left a deep impression on people. He is not only good looking, but also talented. Every time he appears in the public eye, he can attract countless eyes. Whether it is his film and television works or variety shows, you can see his hard work and dedication. So, when we talk about celebrities in the entertainment industry, we must never ignore Zhang Han's existence. This guy is also very hard working in the entertainment industry. He always likes to challenge some young roles. Just like in Gentlemen of East District 8, he is already a lot of age, but he still insists on playing a male college student. That belly, it can't be hidden even if you want to, I can't stand it, it really makes people uncomfortable. In the drama Pearl River Family, although he is already 40 years old, he plays a young man in his 20s without any sense of disobedience. Even if he eats a mushroom, he can perform that greasy feeling, which makes people can't help but think, wow, this guy is really strong. This acting skill is really admirable. Originally, it was a plot closely related to food, but Zhang Han's acting directly killed the audience's appetite. I wanted to see something delicious, but after watching his performance, I didn't want to eat anything. His acting skills are really ridiculous, and it has nothing to do with food. Want to lose weight but can't control your mouth? Then come and watch Zhang Han's eating show. I guarantee that you won't want to eat after watching it. Every bite of his food is so delicious, but you can definitely feel the sense of urgency of eating show is good, but losing weight is more important. In this way, you can better control your appetite and stick to losing weight. But then again, if there is a master like Wallen in a drama, then a character like Feng Chu must be indispensable. It's like making a big meal, you need all kinds of condiments and side dishes to make it look good. Yang Shuo plays Zhang Han's older brother in this drama. In fact, the age difference between the two characters is not much. They are both young and energetic teenagers. Watching them go back and forth on the screen, it feels like two brothers, which is quite interesting. Director, look at Yang Shuo's face. He looks like an old tree bark that has become a spirit. Can this really convince the audience? Let's be honest, this image is a bit out of tune. Can we think about it from another angle and see if we can find some actors who are more suitable for the role to play, so that the audience can also feel comfortable watching it, don't you think? It's really ridiculous. This guy actually went to cut a pot cover head to look younger, but the effects was not at all. He looked more like the honest eldest son of the village chief's family. It's really making things worse. In the past two years, Huo Hao has followed the trend and joined the ranks of male actors who like to act young. He has also begun to try younger and more energetic roles, showing a different charm from before. I have to say that this change is really eye-catching and makes people look forward to his future performance. In the drama Coward, his face is full of wrinkles, but the character is a high school student. Although he used a lot of filters to cover it up, 
The old look is still obvious and can't be blocked. It really makes people a little out of the play, and it doesn't seem to fit the role setting. It's also quite interesting to say that in the drama The Unspeakable, he challenged another role. This time he played an 18-year-old boy who was about to go to the army. When he confessed to the heroine, he pretended to be very shy and embarrassed. But this kind of performance is really a bit too much. People really want to skip this part directly. It's really a bit unbearable. Every age group has a role that suits them. For middle-aged male actors, the key is to understand their own positioning and not compete with those young guys for the role. After all, each stage has its own brilliance. Only by finding the one that suits you can you give full play to your best acting skills. Therefore, it is the right way to find your own position and interpret the charm of a middle-aged male actor. To be honest, compared with others, Zhang Hanlin is simply a wise man with a clear mind. Because he played ancient puppet dramas with young actresses before, his popularity almost fell to the bottom. Fortunately, he realized the problem later and made adjustments in time, and finally everyone's love for him was not in vain. In the upcoming drama Legend of the Hidden Sea, Zhang Hamlian is actually going to play the father of Xiao Zan. Imagine that after he puts on a beard, he is still so handsome, but he feels more like a mature man with stability and momentum. This combination is really full of expectations. The correct posture of a middle-aged actor should be like this. It's really eye-catching. Speaking of Ji Lingxin, he played Wang Zhengayu's father this time, which can be said to have saved some praise for himself. This transformation not only allows everyone to see the versatility of his acting skills, but also makes people sigh that he can dare to try different roles, which is really great. To be honest, instead of trying so hard to look young, actors should accept their age calmly, because it is much more important to prove themselves with their strength and roles than to look young. After all, real acting skills and charm cannot be faked by pretending to be young, but need to win the audience's recognition through real performance and deeply rooted character creation. Therefore, actors should pay more attention to their acting skills and character creation, rather than blindly pursuing youthful appearance. 03 Conclusion The casting of the drama Mo Yu Yoon Jian is really confusing. I like it but I am a little dissatisfied. Some of the cast of this drama are really well chosen, which makes people shine. It feels very consistent with the character setting and we enjoy watching it. However, there are also some roles that make us a little confused. It feels far from the image in our minds, which makes people a little disappointed. In general, the casting of this drama still has some highlights and shortcomings. Although the choice of some roles makes people a little entangled, overall, the actors of this drama can still interpret the charm of the characters, allowing us to feel different emotions and experiences in the process of chasing the drama. To be honest, I think the heroine played by Wu Jinian is not as good looking as those supporting actresses and her acting skills are not particularly outstanding. She is more supported by the role setting. It seems unnecessary to promote her so much. Wang Xingai is a handsome guy, but he is still a little immature in acting. Maybe because he is a young actor and does not have enough experience, his performance seems a bit jerky. It seems that he has to work harder to get to the next level. Speaking of which, the supporting actors in this drama are really outstanding, one is better than the other. Look at actors such as Ching Kion, Ji Lingxin, Amy, and Yang Che Oiyu. They all have great performances in the drama and have brought many surprises to the audience. This spirit of daring to break through oneself and constantly challenge new roles is what we actors should learn well. Such acting skills are more impressive and more worthy of our appreciation and expectation. In the entertainment industry, it is quite common for celebrities to want to look young and compete for the leading role. But we audiences are not easy to fool. Who is really capable and who is not good at acting can be seen at a glance. Don't think you can fool us by pretending to be young or grabbing a ranking, the audience's eyes are sharp. Hey, some actors, I advise you to take it easy and stop tossing. Don't always think about fooling yourself and others by being clever, you have to find a role that really suits you, and then think about it with all your heart and make a good film. The most important thing is to constantly hone your acting skills and improve your strength, this is the real thing. Don't always think about those crooked ways, being down to earth is the hard truth. So what do you think of Ji Lingchen's performance in this drama? What do you think of his performance? Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 